Alright, so this is the cheapest RTX 4090 gaming PC, so if you want something that could run games at 4K with only 5% difference between it and something like a 7950X 3D build, which goes for around $33 to $3200, this is the video for you. So yeah, links will be down in the description, and press on that like button if you want to support the channel, and we're not gonna make it any long, let's get to the parts actually. And the CPU, we're looking at the AMD Ryzen 9 7900, uh, the reason I went with that one, because this is a 12 core 24 threaded CPU, it performs the same as a CPU called the Ryzen 9 7900X, which in its turn performs as good as something like the Intel Core i5 13700K in both gaming and multitasking, but the 13700K is more advanced when it comes to the multitasking performance results. Nevertheless, this is a very good CPU to pair with the RTX 4090. It's a pretty power efficient CPU, it's only 65 watt rated, you know. So we're getting really good results in terms of gaming performance, and we're getting really good efficient CPU, and it comes with its own cooler, so you don't need any upgrade. As for the board, we're looking at the Gigabyte. B650M-DS3H and this board goes for around $150. This is an AM5 board, you know. It really gets the job done. You cannot go wrong with it at all. It's not an entry-level board by any means. It's a pretty premium price board, you know. That's for a really decent price. Got PCIe 5.0 support for the future, of course. And it's got 4M slots and it will support our CPU or even the next-gen X3 CPUs just fine once you want to upgrade. As for the RAM, we're looking at 32 gigabytes of DDR5 6000 megahertz RAM and this one goes for around $100. 20 to 130 dollars this rgb actually so yeah you're saving money you're getting the highest rated ram in terms of frequency which will result in better performance overall i mean a more performance than 5200 megahertz let's just say it that way and it's for a budget price it's for 130 dollars and 32 gigs is more than what you'd ever need for a pc like that so you really cannot go wrong and the ssd we're looking at a one terabyte m.2 pcie 4.0 ssd so we're getting the fast boot up times and loading speeds and for a 4k gaming pc i guess one terabyte is a really good space but hey, if you want to go with 2TB, you can also do so. And the GPU, you know what it is. This is the NVIDIA RTX 4090, I believe, from MSI. This one is the cheapest version, but that doesn't mean that it's bad in ventilation or anything like that. But hey, this is the one that goes for a good price, you know, a competitive price. Yeah, so yeah, talking about the RTX 4090, this is one of the fastest, if not the fastest GPU that you can get on the planet right now for gaming. And pairing it with a CPU like the Ryzen 9 7900 doesn't only you provide you in a really good upgrade path, but it will also give you really good 4k 1440p gaming performance the fastest of its kind you know compared to the 13700k compared to the 3900k you really cannot go wrong and the fact that you are building an rtx 4090 pc with this type of specs for the same price of uh maybe a really good rtx 480 pc is a really good thing actually in my opinion and the case we're looking at the ndx h5 flow or h5 elite actually so this is the h5 flow elite you know this one goes for 130 dollars to 140 i always got really good ventilation three fans you know rgb fans so it will hold you fine it's got really good cable management and when it comes to the dimensions uh the rtx 4090 will be really good in terms of fitting compared uh when, when tucked in this pc case and the power supply we're looking at the evga 150 watt 80 plus gold rated power supply this one goes for 130 dollars and believe it or not this pc only consumes around 600 watts flat so the fact that we're pairing this uh pc with 850 watts is more than enough but if you don't feel safe going with the 150 watt you can also go with the gigabyte 1000 watt power supply but let me tell you just out of the bat you actually don't need that so yeah if you like the video press on that like button if you want to see more of that kind subscribe and i'll see you in the next one peace